what is good youtube we are back with another 2k14 my career series in the last video we demanded a trade once and for all and we picked the heat the knicks and the warriors as our three destination spots i hope we go to the knicks and then it'd be fun obviously to play with brian and the boys we had to shout out jackson ellis because he outscored us we really didn't get a fair chance so today we're starting out playing the Pelicans. Y'all know we like to do four games per episode. Breaking down the game, let's take a look here at Thomas Robinson. When you bring his name up, what I can't get out of my head is how ferocious he is as a rebound. You know, my like, bad, West Matthews didn't get traded. Forward. I said it's that in the last end. episode. He's number two. That's all me. We really don't care if we win or lose anymore because we out of here. We're just trying to put on a show for the fans, let them know what they're going to be missing. Robinson is out there with like this, baby. Come on, man. Big dunks, big dunks. Yeah, we're about to do our farewell tour. Give me that. Our next team is going to get a beast. A hungry beast. Someone who wants to be great. That is a ridiculous number. Oh, give me the ball, bro. Eaton was a two-time defensive player of the year. Just a fourth-round pick out of UCLA back in 1982. And one. Tell you what, he sure panned out for the Jazz. And for Tyreek Evans, a player who's had the ball in his hands his whole life, it's had to, you know, be a tough adjustment turning the playoff. Yeah, Get I think it. that's been the big challenge. 2012. He struggled his rookie season and has since been traded twice. Look at this dude. Look at this bomb. Look at this bomb. That's why we're out of here, man. That's why we're gone. We are gone. And I can't wait to put on that new jersey. Can't wait to move in that new crib in the new city, bro. I mean, we we we're done. We're done here. We're out. That is good. Yeah, he's saying my bad, bro. Thomas Robinson, bro, you trash. You trash. It's all to say. Y'all won't give me the ball, bro. Right side, Robinson. Lillard outside. Robinson down low. He's guarded by Davis. That's the third. Seven of 11 from the field in the second quarter. Well, you talk about you talk about a franchise having some terrible luck with injuries. Portland is certainly that team. They're about to have some more terrible luck, Clark. They're about to let a future goat leave. They're about to let a future goat leave because they didn't give me what I needed to succeed. As you said, with the Blazers throughout the ages, they've had to deal with injuries to guys like Walton and Odin, and most recently Roy. Unfortunately, Steve. Starting over is something that they are used to doing. But they are in a pretty good position to do so right now, Kevin. Uh, I think they've been really good in the draft the last couple of nah, years. That's steel. That's steel. Coast to coast, coast to coast, coast to coast. No. Oh. Y'all call that? Roberts passes to it. Shot clock at six. And foul. Give me that, bro. He'll get to the line and shoot two. What the heck? Why am I on the ground? Him, physical tubes can possibly find some easy points playing that position. Marcus Aldridge just checked in for the Trailblazers. No good from Sharp. That's a shot that he sometimes struggles with. But you keep not going to lie. I know most of these players. I do not know who number five is. Call on pass it to Sharp. Aldridge down low. And one. He's coming off a 22 point game against the Timberwolves in Minneapolis. And the offense just getting right to the rim, but at least they saved the layup. Half time, we're up six. Could be our last game as a Blazer, y'all. Yes, guys, I'm here with Anthony Davis. And Anthony, based on how the game has been going so far, what's your attitude going to be when you come out to play the second half? Oh, you know, we got to come out with a great intensity. And it starts in warm up, so we got to come out uh, with a great intensity, great mindset. Let's not go out there and win the third quarter. Anthony, thank you. Guys, it should be all business when you step between the lines. Six minutes left in the fourth. We're up 22. I'm feeling like this is it. It may not be, though. I could be wrong. It probably could be like three or four games. I do remember some 2Ks. It was like five. But again, I haven't played this one in 11 years. So give me that block. 
up his head too. Pass now here in the fourth. So for New Orleans right now, Evans and Anderson. Oh, where are you going? And one. Out there with Holiday, and it's Davis in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And now a look at the upcoming schedule for the New Orleans Pelicans. After this one, they're off to Sacramento to take on the Kings. That will conclude a five-game road trip for them. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for Portland. There we go. Make five free throws in a single game. Yes, sir. Well, Blazers coach Terry Stotts is a branch on the tree of head coach George Carl, and that's a pretty good tree to be on in his playing days. Carl coached Stotts in the CBA. No way. Actually, Stotts in Harvard, too, Clark. Yeah, it's been a really gritty performance. They'll have some bruises to show for it, but that's the way it should be. You should feel it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Y'all going to miss me. Y'all are going to miss me. Exactly like that. I'm a freaking diamond in a rough well, playmaker that y'all just did. didn't give me the chance to show y'all, man. It is what it is. Jumper and a kind he hit that. Wow. As that one falls. It hasn't happened. Drew Holiday, young Drew Holiday. Like, but he's finally putting some points on the board in this game. Bro. Open. Open. That's Holiday. what you get. And that one's good. Y'all are trash, man. He's been much more effective in the second half than he was in the first. So done with this team. That's perfection to me. No way. No way. After this one, they're off to Sacramento to take on the Kings. And that's the final game of this five-game road run for the team. Evans attempts. Give me that block. Give me that block. And Davis puts it. Oftentimes he can put right back up for an easy deuce. Steve, he is always on the prop. Let's get it. Let's give me the ball. Let's give me the ball. All right, 111-84. It's a wrap. Hopefully our last game is a blazer. Let's get out of town, man. We got our bags already packed, boxes ready to go. Stuff's already organized. U-Haul is literally been rented out. For real. Well, Damian, certainly a nice game for you tonight. Tell us about how your approach to the game has developed and your role within this offense. Uh, well, there's a lot of pick and roll in the NBA right now. Uh, scoring point guards that stay in attack mode and make the right plays are the most successful. And, uh, you know, that's what they want me to be. Um, they want me to make plays and be aggressive offensively. And um, I'm most successful that way. You know, I mean, I think I thrived in it tonight. You have the talent to do exactly that, Danny. 276 VC in the bank. Let's get it. We ain't getting traded yet. No acceptable trades were found with your desired teams. You could try again with different teams. Oh my God, we're not good enough. That's unbelievable. We're stuck. Three threes on you, bro. I can't believe that. I really cannot believe that. Bro, wait till I get my speed up. Are right, we putting layup up four? Are right, we playing the Clippers in the heat? Bro, I cannot believe these teams don't want me. I can't believe it. I go to the Clippers. Mash for the Clippers. Second quarter, six minutes left. God, I can't believe we're still on this team, bro. I'm legit mad. I'm legit mad. Oh, for sure, we'd be donning. And I had to call the U-Haul company and said, man, I have to get that deposit back. The dish to Barnes. Back to Paul. Beyond the arc. That's good from Barnes. On Bro, the why are you ball. leaving him open? I got the paint. You can cheer me. Yeah, that, that's interesting. Defense, something that usually needs to be learned in the NBA and the Blazers. Or a young nope. team last season, Steve, and, and easily a, a, a team learning game by game. Yeah, youth or not, though, Kevin. I mean, 48% uh, against you defensively uh, in terms of field goal percentage. Bro, why is that my man? Jordan with a screen on Lillard. And here's Barnes for three. And a great assist by Paul. This is unreal. Goes in of assist. And you look at this list of the all-time leaders. You're looking at the legends of the game. The greats of the game. Come on, man. I'm butter. Yeah, I'm smooth like with it. Paul gets a screen from Griffin. Takes the three. And another three. They don't the miss. Birds. They don't That's miss. Howard. He also wants to see a lot of bodies down low at the defensive end. Saying, quote, if they're going to be this, let's Block. Give me that. Guys, they've got a decent hole to dig themselves out of, but still a lot of time left to do it. Oh, once he was there. But you know what's going to happen. They sent a message right there. Nothing easy inside. 
Antoine Jameson's checked in for the Clippers. Dudley comes in for Barnes. Leonard with a screen on Dudley. It's blocked. Dude, I wanted to shoot an elbow J, and it brought There's me to Wayans, the freaking paint. By Lillard. Wayne's off a pick from Hollins. To the left wing. Paul goes in. Takes it into the teeth of the D and converts the layup. Here at the hustle stands for the Clippers. Now, Kevin, in the first half of play, they're really closing out aggressively, blocking shots, a, a key indicator of their activity. Let's go. Let's go. Right, the lead being maintained will not be a problem if they keep shooting the way they have so far. Oh, oh my gosh. Between Art and the league is. I think I would have to put Steph Curry in that conversation now. But I would lean towards Paul's dominance and ability to turn around the Clippers. Give me that. The top point guard in the NBA. I don't, I don't know. The best oh my gosh! Excellent timing again. Mike comes in for Lamarcus Aldridge. Matthews, he's checked in for Cramp, and it's Williams in for Lillard. Here's Money. He's guarding No good from Sharp. And they've got a bit that you've competed when you do that work inside. Here's Williams, right with it. Now guarded by Dudley. Let's get him in. Let's go. No. Gotta be kidding me. That'll do it for the first half. Flip. Hey, Kevin, I'm here with Blake Griffin. And Blake, what's been the key tonight on how this first half has turned out for you guys? Uh, we just have a lot of different pieces, a lot of veteran pieces, a lot of uh, you know, skill pieces. And, and you know, they're coming all together right now. And, and you know, it, it makes it a lot easier for us. Thanks for your time, Blake. Kevin, back to you. You know, Paul is playing really well. He's got 17 points and this huge assist challenge. Money. All the more I'm wet. Well, Let's go. Third quarter action getting rolling right now. Brought to you by Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Give me that block. Setting the floor for the Clippers. CP3 a point with Reddick in the back. Oh, man. That's green. I'm Time. Like y'all need to start giving me that. Firmly in control of this game. They have not let me three threes. I need to hit th two more threes. Here's Griffin. And off the left oh side my of the God, rim, dude. Swirls in for the pass to Sharp. And if you're just joining us, we play a little bit here in the third. He's one guy the defense is not afraid to leave open from that range, and for obvious reasons. Here's Reddick, and foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. How is that a foul? And Portland making a change here. Robinson's checked in. Here's Sharp. Woo. Kept alive. Another green. Another green. Soon, they're a ball on the floor and get to the rim and finish. I think he's become an excellent guard in this league. And I think Doris and one. has something for us right now. Doris? Well, a lack of effort on the defensive glass, saying he wanted to see them exerting a lot more energy to prevent second Kevin. He's going to have to hope those changes take effect quickly. Thank you, Doris. Check out the game for money. 12 points. The difference between Paul against Lillard. And again, Bro, they Paul. don't miss. Like they do not miss. Masterful performance across the board. And don't forget, on the road too. Excellent timing again. Road records in the Western Conference last year, going 24 and 17. Steve actually tied for the second most road wins in the West, only behind the Thunder. And believe it or not, Kevin, it's the first time the Clippers franchise has ever had a winning record on the road. Actually. Thank you. Thank you. Green bean machine, baby. Just give me the ball. 16 points, career high. We need one more three. We need one more three. Paul, right side. Whose man is that? Paul's got six points in the Y'all not put defense? They don't. They don't here. And we are stuck here. We're stuck. And that's not the kind of streak you want to have if you're playing defense. Back to Lillard. Lock at six. And there is a call on Matt Barnes. That's his third foul of the game. Nicholas Batum. He's checked in for Wesley Matthews. Sharp, the pass to Batum. The 
Charlotte Trailblazers need to get off a shot. And out of bounds as Los Angeles gains possession. High field goal percentage ranking. I mean, he's got both the technique and the patience and discipline that all really great shooters no way. have to have to be wow. efficient. And Clark angry. <laughs> That's a heck of a combination. Pretty pass and an angry punch. I would call it an irate finish either. Why are you passing to him? Lamarcus is wide open. Oh my goodness, bro. We're checked out. We've checked out. We've checked out, bro. And that's now a moment here to take a look at some of the hustle stats for the Clippers. Boy, defensively, they've played with a high energy level, guys. And a three? Steals we've seen. Nope. Out on the break tonight as well. And Need one more three. We got 18 points, though. And they double up Paul. Career high. Griffin with it. Robinson picks him up. And here's Barnes for three. And again, it's the Clippers from deep. Yeah, and guys, it's. Lillard, the pass to Sharp. From outside the arc. Again, Give me that. Social media challenge completed. 20 points in the game. 21 to be exact, man. Let's go. We leveling up. Arvmont has not changed, GM. I know what you're seeing. Give me that. Fucking block, baby. Get that out of here. Fires from 18. I'll pop him out no matter what. Well, you know, we all know about Chris Paul's defensive ability. I know he's always amongst the league leaders in steals, but he's a dogged defender and really enjoys getting Need up into Need some Gatorade, coach. Well, eventually he'll start knocking those down again. He did make two in the first half. A two, good. Man, a gaping hole in the defense that time, and he didn't waste I any time. I need some Gatorade, before. coach. Los Angeles leading by 15. Y'all playing me too Paul much, man. Dominating, though. Griffin dishes to Jordan. Give me that steal. The Clippers, of course. The Clippers retain possession. But he held the Clippers' feet to the fire before he did, pressuring them to acquire coach Doc Rivers, who was also given final say in the front office. Around off the court as well as on it. Kevin? Well, he's certainly doing just that. Thank you, Doris. Bullock. And another three for the Clippers. It's and unbelievable. Just dropping from I mean, really, right it, it's yeah, crazy. Time, Steve. They've been operating very efficiently. Inside, poke loose. What was that? The tomb was wide open. Last season. Seven seconds left in the third. McCollum passes to Sharp. Oh, Excellent timing. Again. The more shots he gets from here on out, the more they'll stretch out this lead. Pass to Sharp. Let's the three fly. <laughs> And it's Williams with the rebound. More often than I'm just today, throwing it up. I don't even care, man. For him. Eight of twenty-two. Williams off a pick from Jameson. Collison for three. Good. Collison's got five points now this quarter. The assist totals. I mean, they have been dominant in that category. It's the ball movement, the player movement, the great rhythm. To Go, the baby. Give me that alley. Seems to me a difficult part. They are going to continue to let him fly. Here's McCollum. <laughs> Here's Leonard. Cannot hit. Nice team. Team is terrible. They're so bad. Like they're so bad. Wayne's the best to Collison. Jamison. I hate to be this negative, but I mean, I know y'all are seeing what I'm seeing. Feeds it to Holland, and it's good. Boy, they are having their way in the paint right now. Here's Cram. He's covered by Collison. Six to shoot, and right kicks to Cram. Here's Sharp. You're fired. Here's Leonard. And he battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. Middle. Jamison dishes to Hollins. Bullock passes to Jamison. Sinks the triple. No way. On this run and ball really lining him up defensively. Leonard kicks to McCoy. Mismatch. Mismatch. There's the pass to Again. Sharp. Game I hate this quarter, team, bro. They want me to not succeed, so bro. What's that? Give that block. Give me that block again. And they'll keep possession. Here's Wayans. Here's Bullock. And fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. Stretch offensively. They desperately need a basket. You suck. No good from Sharp. I think he's Tired. Got to regroup Gatorade. And get himself together here. Played the whole second half. Going wrong with him this quarter. He's really falling off. We're down by 40. 22 and 19 here in Portland. 
Well, it was a young team, very talented starting five, but very little depth. And I think over the course of an 82-game season, the lack of... McCollum with the ball. Pass to Sharp. Off the screen. Thank you. Money's got 14 points now in the second half. Very Why am I always hitting twos, jumper, though? That was the key to that 23 points, though, man, off like 30 shots. Wayne's it's all good, though. So he gets the whistle, contact on the way up, and two shots come. Probably get zero VC. You know, nah, we can't, though. We got that social media challenge. Well, that's more than luck, Kevin. I mean, that steal. See, bro, these teams are terrible, man. God, they're bad. This is just the first How of three be that bad? For the good win to go up 1-0 on the year against the Trailblazers. Then you have to look back at this and see what a huge game it's been for Chris Paul. And a big part of their success was his ability to keep the ball moving and finding guys when they would flash open. Oh my god, bro. This team is terrible. You know, for so long the Clippers were These guys are terrible. Hey Kevin, I'm here with Blake Griffin and Blake, the team was really clicking out here tonight. How does it feel to be able to play like this? Uh, it was great. You know, the best part about it is, is uh, everybody was playing. You know, we were all on uh, all in our best game and then we all played well and, and that's what we did tonight. That's just promising. Thanks for your time, Blake. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, Doris. And folks, that about concludes our broadcast tonight. For Steve Kerr, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching as we leave you with our Jordan player of the game, Chris Paul. 218 VC. We'll take that. Great game out there tonight. You set your career high in points. Was this just a one-time outburst, or do you see yourself scoring like this on a regular basis? Believe me, this is a conversation we're going to be having several more times in the future. I may have got my career high tonight, but that's just for tonight. I'm getting better every day, so don't be surprised if I top that mark next game. And the game after that, and the game after that, I feel like the sky's the limit for me, you know? Players in the league, Kevin, because of the versatility at both ends of the floor. On defense, that huge wingspan allows him to cover. And then offensively, he can really run the floor in transition, and he can knock down that three-point shot. Second quarter, we're in the game, and we're guarding LeBron. Score or assist on a few baskets in a row. All right. Lillard attacking, pass to Aldridge. And Odin sends it back. They've shown effort and aggression in the paint right from the tip. Their rebounding edge is impressive. Let's go, LeBron. You know I'm Dean. You up, my man. Out of those rebounds into points at the other end. On the floor for my Wow. On the way. More energy in the post. Maybe some double teaming. They've got to get their defense in gear. There's the thank Aldridge. you. The hey, bro's hugging me, man. The pass to Cole. Back to LeBron. Who's guarding D-Wade? go from deep. And it's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. Now we get a chance to check out the standings out east already. We are in December. Taking a look at Miami. Earning the first place position with the team. Brandon Roy and Greg Oden. It's nice to see the Blazers bounce back and start to get all Hit me, bro. Off like the slit. And Batum and Matthews. Wow, LeBron just ripped me. Unbelievable, dude. James with it. Now defended by Sharp. Let's go. And stolen by Lillard. And now Lillard running the floor all by himself. There's that transition offense. Push. Allen kicks to Cole. LeBron James on the wing. In to Greg Oden. And there. Let's go. Rebound. And this is their first time matched up with this year's Heat team. And of course, two teams in opposite conferences. Uh, bad shot, bad shot, bad shot, bad East shot. Four. I admit that. I admit that. By James. Cole dishes to Anderson. Odin passes to LeBron. And he's going up for the alley oop. And Anderson slams it in. Phenomenal alley oop. Unbelievable. Right At time, we down 15, man. It ain't looking good. With their exposure and obviously coach some great work tonight on the defensive side of the ball how does the team's defense play into your offense it just energizes us we have an ignitable group um, and, and that's how we play so we have to continue to stay the course 
uh, and try to keep him off the two point line as best as we can. Eric, thank you. Kevin, over to you. Oh my gosh, get the lead down to 10. I hate these dynamic goals, bro, because they don't. Here in the third quarter, Sharp in its small forward. Williams out there with McCollum. Terrible shot. Terrell Wright, and it's Robin. McCollum off a pick from Sharp. Wide open. And the basket by McCollum. How is that a bad call for pass? I'm wide open. Why should I not call for the ball? Have they not heard that this guy is unbelievable? That's a layup for him. Sharp. Wide open. Excellent. He's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Chalmers dishes to James. Kicks it to Aslam. Outside Bosch. Again, the heat good for two. Got a lot of momentum going. Catch it. And not only does he do it, but he powers it down from there. The timing of these players. Another excellent shot, dude. On the floor for Miami. Start the Seems fourth. so Aslam just utterly. Utterly disappointing. Yeah. That's not a rebound. Again, they try me again. Williams with the ball. No Williams, pull up, brick. Defense there, you really have to challenge him at that range. Allen kicks to Chalmers. It's blocked by that Schultz. block. Now here's McCullum, defended by Allen. Sharp, the pass to right. Bangs home the trifecta. Wright's got the first. This Bosch readily said it at times that uh, his team had a difficult time lighting that fire again. And to go back to what Bosch said. I think that is true for every team, Clark, that comes off a championship. Why can I hit that? Don't admit it like Bosch did. Well, you know what? Once you've won it all, there is a bit of a relief and a little malaise. That make guys, and, and all the steals we've seen, really a result of that aggressiveness. They've repeatedly gotten out on the break tonight as well. And like, I, I don't understand this defense. Great looking bounce pass they stop guarding right, let's go plays the all the time. Well, over the it, break, it's it's in unreal. Dots had to say in his huddle. He thinks the use of ball screens against this defense would make a huge difference, and that's what he relayed to his players. Also, he wants them building a wall around the ring. To the wing right side. Harris with it. Lillard picks him up. That is good. He made that, man. Seven point. And Matthews kicks to Lillard. Robinson dishes to Matthews. And there's the pass to Sharp. Aldridge with a screen on Haslam. Here's Sharp. And, he and one, baby. Thank you. Screenplay work. Haslam against Robinson. Haslam, the pass to James. <laughs> the what, baby. Sharp. And that's out of Sit bounds. down, LeBron. Will retain possession. That's a, a game they'd really like to have. Lillard, the pass to Sharp. Bro, I, I just don't get it. Excellent it shot time for being B plus quality. Offensively speaking. I mean, Harris outside. Only, only thing I can think of is attributes. Like that's it. Fires for three, and James gets it to go on the assist by Harris. Definitely a big improvement in their shooting from what we saw before the break. Passes it to Sharp. Thank you. Thank you. Money's got five points now in the quarter. Defense nowhere to be seen. Lillard, the pass to Sharp. In low to Aldridge. Right wing from downtown. <laughs> no good from Sharp. And we head to the final buzzer in a crushing blowout. Big time dominance. This will go in the books as a really gaudy win for the Heat. Lillard gets the screen from Sharp. Look at this, bro. This team is... You already know. I don't even have to say it. Getting blown out. Feeds to Aslam. On left to the wing. Here's Sharp. Oh, really? No good on the three. Joke. Like he's just trying to shoot his way out of this cult. Harris outside. Primo. Give me that block. This game is finally getting away from me. Yep, it has gotten away. There's not really anything they can do now. Let's it go from 11. Yes, sir. Nice play there from Sharp. Really did a nice that mid-range jumper. Gonna take another blowout L, man. 
but this team is just testing my patience. Thank you, Kevin LeBron. You are in the midst of yet another great season, posting tremendous individual numbers and the team with an outstanding record. Is this the type of season that you set out to achieve right from the get-go? Uh, I just wanted to play well. Uh, you know, this whole season, you know, I got back to what I know I'm capable of doing, and that's having fun with this game and, uh, you know, just, just believing in myself and my teammates. So uh, I, I'm happy to be in a good place. Thank you for the time, sir. Guys, back to you. Thank you, Doris. 172 BC. Okay. Nothing to brag about. Arena tunnel after the game. Hey, man. Glad I caught you. I was hoping to have a chance to talk with you for a few minutes before getting out of here. What's up, LeBron? So listen, I just wanted to let you know that you caught my eye. I've liked your attitude, and I see the potential in your game. Thanks, man. It's nice to hear coming from you. But you got a long way to go. When I see a young guy like you with the chance to make a real impact in this league, I'd like to try to share some of the things I've learned early on that helped me to be successful. Yeah, I'm always willing to listen to one of the greats. What you got? All right, so there's three things I've always tried to stress to a player at this point in their career. First, try to give your mind a break every once in a while. I mean, if all you do is think about basketball, it can become too much. Take some time before the game, clear your head, listen to some music, read a book, do whatever. Just make sure you can get away enough to refocus mentally and get yourself in the right place. That's cool, I can dig that. What else you got? Okay, second, be smart with your decisions. Be careful who you associate yourself with. And don't forget that there's always people around who will try to take advantage of you. For sure. I've experienced some of that already, man. You have no idea, man. And third, but most important, keep pushing yourself to the limit. If you ain't willing to put in the time, you better believe there's a hundred other players that are. Hard work will take you a long way, man. Don't let your talent go to waste. That's a lot to think about. I'm definitely going to keep it in my mind, though. You do that. I'm sure we'll be meeting up again sometime soon. Looking forward to seeing what else you can do, both on and off the floor. Hey, thanks, man. I really appreciate you coming over and talking to me today. Oh, for sure, man. Good luck with the rest of the season. I don't see Bron going up to any other blazer besides your boy. He sees me. Here we go. GM's office. Thanks for stopping by. As you know, it's important for me to regularly check in with all of our players. So, how you feeling about? We want to trade the still. Season. I want to trade. I'm just gonna come right out and say it. I'm done here. I want to be traded. <sighs> okay. Uh, I wasn't expecting that. Look, I'm gonna take this request seriously. But before I make anything official. I want you to take a couple of All right, we've seen this cutscene. We're just going to get straight past this. We know what we need to do. We need to keep playing better. Get these teams to trade for your boy. Yeah, that's it. All right, the Heat and the Knicks are actually creeping up, y'all. But we're actually not going to do the Heat. It'd be cheesy to go with LeBron and them boys. But we're going to definitely do the Knicks. I'm thinking the Warriors again and the Clippers. I'm thinking the Clippers. Clippers would be fresh. Well, I think the biggest strength for Evans is his penetration and finishing ability. He's a strong kid, deceptive ball handler. Austin Rivers challenged us to a social media challenge. Rest of the quarter, bro. Hi. With he passes to Anderson. Upside Thomas. He feeds it to Roberts. He dishes it to Anderson. Five on the clock. Knocked loose. Matthews with the steal. Anderson with the inside. Ryan Roberts out there at Rivers. And it's Thomas in at the small forward. So that's the group out there for New Orleans. So he gave them a bit of a boost. 
he had nine points and played some lockdown defense as well, causing havoc on both ends of the floor. He really was the second unit for his team in a great performance, guys. Thank you, Doris. He was <laughs> the uh, <laughs> uh, Y'all got to give me that. Yeah, like he did everything they asked of him and more. And I think he really enjoys being that coach. Here's Roberts. Off the left rim and out. Well, he's been trying to add that mid-range shot to his arsenal, but it still isn't there. Matthews with it. Now defended by Anderson. Layout, baby. Let's get down it. Down Paint and more on the perimeter to contest those perimeter jump shots. Guys, they're clearly hoping those changes have an effect even before this game makes it to halftime. Kevin? Thank you, Doris. The timely screen gave him a step, but he took it off. Time. And for Rivers, a great ball here, but he's a little under wide open. Doesn't have that wide open. Athleticism, I, guess I, I think I made it tougher for him to adjust to the floor. There was no looking back, straight to the rack. The pass to Sharp, a three ball. The rebound by uh. Whippy. I tell you what, you can shake your confidence. Rivers kicks to Whippy. Aldridge with the block. Now Williams. Six points for him. Thank you. Money's got five now. I was subbed out. Down six. Third and Matthews pair up in the backcourt. And it's Here's Davis. Pass to Evans. And he recovers it. Holiday dishes to Davis. And Holiday kicks to Anderson. Lets it go with a three. And it's Portland with the rebound. Evans and Anderson, the forwards. Austin Rivers is out there with Holiday. And it's Davis at the five, roaming the paint. That's the Pelicans' five. And one team is just team is so trash, man. The other I just tonight. can't say it enough. How bad they are. What is turning out to be a monster win here Give me that again. Right, so I'm a blocking machine, man. Pitch player of the year. The they were just uh, at times part, seemed toying with. Yeah, like watching a cat play with a mouse, Kevin. Yeah. Quite honestly, they were able to do more or less whatever they wanted. Oh. Look at that leg. Uh, uh, quick trigger. He can catch the ball in space, defenders all over him, but you know, in an instant, lets that shot go, and he is accurate. Shot and game clock separated by five, rejected by Sharp Evans, and can't hit the shot. But there's a blocking assassin. I'm not even trying to block, and I'm still blocking. That's a wrap, y'all. 111 to 83. We just gotta stay aggressive, and um, you know, we just did that in the second half. So it started in the first quarter when we came out. Um, our offense was clicking, but most important, our defense was clicking. And then when you do that, it's hard to beat up. Stay aggressive, Anthony. Thank you so much, guys. Doris, thank you. And for Steve Kerr, Clark Kellogg, and Doris Burke, and the rest of our great 2K Sports crew. 250 BC and another loss. That's going to do it for this episode. We did not get traded, but we are still on the prowl to do so, man. If y'all enjoyed the video, for all the new viewers, please hit that subscribe button. Everyone watching, please smash the like button. Greatly helps out. The channel obviously motivates me to keep doing these for you guys, but I uh, sincerely appreciate all the support. I'm going to see y'all next time. We're playing the Thunder to start out the next episode, so lock in. Y'all have a blessed night. Peace.